Here are the five most important settings you need to turn on on your YouTube channel to start getting views and start getting subscribers on your channel. You have to endeavor to watch this video to the end as I'm going to be showing you the last most important tips at the end of this video. Now, I'm going to be using my phone to show you this. It's the same process you are going to be following on your laptop. And now we have to go to um, google web browser when you get to google web browser or any web browser you are using so now when you get to your web browser you are going to uh, type inside this search bar we are going to search for youtube studio so when you search for this youtube studio it's going to open up like this and from here first you have to turn your chrome viewing to desktop site so to do that you go to these three dots and when you tap on that three dots from here at the downside here you are going to see desktop site so you just tap on that to enable that and your screen is going to be smaller what you are going to do is to use your finger your two finger to zoom zoom out your screen so i'm going to zoom out my screen so that i can see what i am tapping on so the problem most of you are going to be having is this when you are trying to tap on the youtube studio it's going to redirect you to your youtube studio app to avoid that what you have to do is to go you go to your phone make sure you in, uninstall the youtube studio app first then after that after uh, working after doing these settings then you can install your youtube studio back so that it will not direct you back to your youtube studio app so i have done that already so i'm going to proceed with this tutorial now so after uninstalling it i tap on the youtube studio website is going to take you to an interface like this from this interface what you are going to do you are going to um, zoom out your screen like i said using your two finger then from there you will see there is a um, three lines there just tap on that three line to bring out um, this particular expand this option so now you will scroll down to the last part of this page from this last part of this page you are going to see settings so what we are going to do is to tap on settings and when you tap on that settings you are going to see this you can zoom, pinch out your screen to zoom in like this and from this option you are going to see uh, we have what we hear we have general channel upload default permission community and agreement so the first settings we have to um, turn on is their country of residence now you are going to go to this place from here you will see um, channels just tap on that channels and from there you are going to see there's another information here we have country of residence um select tap on the country of residence and please if you are in nigeria make sure you are using your country so that you don't run into problem when you are trying to monetize your youtube channel so i'm in nigeria i'm going to select nigeria as my country of residence and that is that the second settings you need to turn on is the advanced settings to do that simply go over to your screen set, um, tap on advanced settings and when you tap on that advanced settings you are going to see your audience so if you if your channel is set for kids then you can select it from here if your channel is not set for kids so that you don't have to be selecting this anytime you're uploading your video then you can just um, select the no set this channel as not made for kids so that anytime you are going to upload your video is not going to ask you this again then if you are uploading your video i need to set it back to um, this video is made for kids then you can just you will see the option there when you're uploading your video and you turn it on so i'm going to turn that off because i'm not going to be making videos that is meant for kids so next settings you need to turn on is to add tags to your youtube channel this um, keywords it helps youtube to categorize where your channel is on so that it knows the audience is going to um, take your videos to so now what we are going to do is to go back to basic you can see we have basic info here just tap on the basic info when you tap on that you are going to see option called keywords what we are going to do is you are going to add these keywords according to the um the type of video you are, you are creating and what your channel is on so let's say for example we are uh, talking about african folk taste but it is applicable to any channels at all so what we are going to do is to tap on the add keywords there so um let's say african folk taste that is what our channel is on african folk taste so you will give space like this and when you are done typing you hit 
you um, click on the enter on your um, keyboard. So I'm going to click on that enter and you can see um, that keyword has been added. Now you go ahead and add another keyword again. So let's say for this one, we are going to add Nigerian stories, Nigerian stories. To enter again on your keyboard and that will be added then you can zoom out like this and um, continue adding your tags according to what your channel is all about so if you see here you can add um, characters up to 500 characters so that is what you can add there and when you're done adding your keywords like i said you tap on the save button here and that will be saved so the next settings we are going to talk talk about is your default upload to do that you go to your screen again and from here you will see what they call upload default so you just select upload default and from here you are going to see we have um, basic information so what this upload default does is that you are going to add um you are going to add some information that you want to use in the description of all your videos so let's say you want to add social links or you want to add tags on your description and you don't want to continue doing this on all your videos you can go through this process and add it once and for all and when you're uploading your videos this is going to be added on your description all you have to do by that time is to write the other necessary details of the description on your video and the final one which i told you i'm going to talk about is called feature eligibility so from here we are going to talk about how to verify your phone number and how to verify using um, video verification and all the necessary details so turn this feature eligibility on what you have to do is to come to um, channels here you can see channel here just select that and from this option you can see we have feature el eligibility you are going to tap on that to turn that on and when you do that you are going to see these options that are here we have the standard features what this standard features does is that you will be able to upload videos you'll be able to create a um, playlist you'll be able to add collaborators to your playlist and you can see other details that are here so let's close that you can see my channel is enabled for that next one here is intermediate features so you can zoom out your screen so that you can see what you we are talking about so from here what you can do when you are enabled for this you can upload videos longer longer than 15 minutes you can add custom thumbnails you can do live streaming so most of you have been having challenges concerning adding thumbnails to your videos now to um, enable this you have to verify your phone number okay that is what you have to verify so to verify your phone number i'm going to talk more about this in my next video so subscribe to the channel so that you stay updated when i post that video because we can't cover that now in this video you have to click on the verify phone number and provide your necessary phone number to verify your phone number then the advanced features that we have available here is this third eligi eligibility feature that we have here is the advanced features these advanced features when you're eligible for this you'll be able to um, appear for content id claims let's say someone uses your content on their channel then you can um, file for content id claims then you can create more live stream or low more videos daily as the case may be then another thing you can do here for you to be eligible for this you have to um, use uh, video verification uh, using your face and all that then you have to use either id card or channel history no, um, depending on how many videos you have uploaded on your channel um, this feature will be turned on automatically okay that is that but before you can do this you have to turn verify your phone number before you can do this so thank you guys and that is that on the five most important settings you need to turn on for you to start getting views and getting subscribers on your channel so thank you guys for watching and i will see you in my next video